This year's winner is Miranda Kerr. Fifteen years ago, she won the Dolly Covergirl contest. How old are you, Miranda? Thirteen. Since then, she's gone on to score some of modelling's best assignments. These days, she turns down most job offers, choosing to work just a day or two a week, spending the rest of her time raising Flynn. On a day-to-day -day basis, when you just have him, when you don't I just have, have him, I don't five have any, nannies texting no, I don't you around. Have any help. When I'm working, um, obviously I have help, but when I'm not working, it's just he and I. Can you please text my mum and see how Flynn is? Do you miss Flynn when he's not here? Yeah, he just actually went home because Orlando's here, so he went home to play. Orlando's like, can Flynn come home and play with me? So I was like, of course. Orlando, of course, is her movie star husband, Orlando Bloom. They keep their careers separate and don't do interviews together. After three years of dating, they married last July. And in January, they were joined by Flynn. What drew you to Orlando? I think it was his persistence with me. <laughs> yeah, he yeah, he was... Maybe he wanted me because he felt like he couldn't have me or something. I don't know. <laughs> Playing hard to get. Yeah. Were you reluctant to date a movie star? Yeah, that's what, was, that's what I was reluctant about. Not about him. I was just reluctant about the idea of that. Is there any little niggly thing he does, like leave the toothpaste lid off or anything like that? Oh, I can't give away his secrets. <laughs> <laughs> That's part of being a good wife. <laughs> Very good. Yeah. Miranda is one of modelling's most laid back stars. <gasps> oh. oh. <laughs> Could have been bad. <laughs> Would have been funny, actually. Yeah. Would have made for good TV. Beautiful win. She puts it down to a very humble upbringing with its fair share of hardships. At school, she was bullied. And at 15, she went through a deep depression after her boyfriend, Chris, was killed in a car crash. He was my first love and we were both young and, you know, we talked about everything from, you know, getting married and having children together and then he died so instantly, so it was quite a shock. Flynn's actually, um, his, his name's Flynn Christopher after my boyfriend and that was a lovely thing that Orlando said, you know, if you want, then you can do that. Because it was something that I'd always thought that I would do. And I'd written a letter to Chris when he had died. And I'd said, you know, when I have a, a child, I will, you know, name him after you. So that's what I did. So, yeah. Do you think he'd be proud of you now? I think so, yeah. Yeah, I think he would be. In January this year, her family suffered another loss. Her grandparents' home, where Miranda spent much of her childhood, was destroyed by lightning. What a surprise! Oh my god! What a surprise! Isn't that a lovely look at his Oh, what a surprise! Hello, darling. Oh, come to your nanan. Oh, you know. Oh, isn't he? Oh, wanted to do this for so long. He did the darling, but you wouldn't cry. No. Nanny loves her little baby. Yes, she do. Yes, she do. <laughs> Nanny loves her little baby. She loves her little baby. Nanny loves her little baby. Yes, she do. You're beautiful. What would you say to the husbands out there who were saying, why don't you look like Miranda Kerr a couple of months after you've had your baby? <laughs> I'd say appreciate what you've got, sweetheart, you know? Your wife is who she is and that's what you fell in love with and just support her because the more you support her and tell her how amazing she is, the more she's going to shine. Oh, it's very ladylike, isn't it? Very demure. Very demure. Miranda knows modelling won't last forever, which is why she's gone into business with her mum. So this is going to be our new lip balm. Yes. They've created Cora, a range of organic skincare products. Now her dad and brother work for the company as well. I've got my family involved, which is the best thing I've ever done. Love it. To Miranda, nothing is more important than family. 
He's a beautiful boy. I'm really blessed to have wonderful parents and incredible grandparents. And as you can see, we just love each other and we have fun no matter where we are. He's a little bit <laughs> Look at him flirting. Do you want a big family? I don't know. Oh. <laughs> we, might need, we might need some movie. I always thought I would have three. And now I'm just trying to enjoy Flynn. And they say the first three years of the child's life are really important, so I want to make sure that those... He gets, you know, the attention and the love and the nurturing that he really needs. So we'll see what happens.